Right. So we've already reviewed the requirements and let's now go on to the next step and start getting ready to enroll our device for autopilot. So the first thing that we would need to do is we to need to enable automatic MDM enrollment. This is important because this is pretty much what's going to let the device to be enrolled into Azure Active Directory and Intune without a user, which is pretty much what we want. So in order to do that, we need to go to the Azure portal, so which is this one right here. Uh, please don't get confused with the Intune or Microsoft Endpoint Manager admin, which is this one, which we will come back to this one in the later steps. So once you're in your Azure portal, you go to the Azure Active Directory. And from here, we're going to go to the Mobility MDM and MAM from there to Microsoft Intune. And here, uh, we just need to make sure that the our MDM user scope is selected to all. And that's pretty much it for this step.